Hi, I'm Mark, and today on my midday devolution video, I want to talk about whales. Helping to protect whales from cyber attacks, creating new jobs with a pipeline of future talent for the UK's fast growing cyber ecosystem, is at the heart of a new cyber action plan for whales that was recently launched by Economy Minister Vaughan Geething. And the new plan is. Cyber Action Plan for Wales sets out how Wales' leading cyber sector can support the growth of the Welsh economy, ensuring Wales can prosper through cyber resilience, talent and innovation. The COVID-19 pandemic has accelerated the prominence and importance of digital in the lives of the people of Wales. And this reliance has led to an increase in the risk of more common and sophisticated cyber attacks. I know what I'm talking about. The Welsh Government's Digital Strategy for Wales sets a vision of improving the lives of everyone through collaboration, innovation and better public services. Effective cyber defence and resilience, a strong cyber business sector and people, businesses and public servants who are cyber aware are crucial to achieving this vision. While cyber resilience and security is at the core of the Welsh Government's new plan, cyber also offers major economic opportunities as the growing sector in Wales leads the way across the UK. The plan sets out a vision for cyber in Wales and um, how the Welsh Government will work collaboratively across sectors. And those sectors include, first of all, security and resilience. That means ensuring businesses, organizations and public services take steps to reduce the risks and to prepare for and deal with and recover from cyber incidents. Then there's the economy. That's an essential industry of the future with global reach and cyber can support the growth of the Welsh economy. High quality jobs within careers that allow young people to plan ambitious futures in Wales are crucial to their long term prosperity. And then there's skills. Ensuring Wales has the right talent to support businesses and public services with the cyber skills they need is essential. Then there's the cyber ecosystem. Wales is leading some of the most innovative work on cyber with one of the biggest cyber ecosystems in the UK and is home to global players in the cyber industry. The Cyber Action Plan builds on this success, seeking to harness the cross-cutting opportunities from close partnership working. The plan focuses on maximizing existing investments and partnerships to achieve greater outcomes for Wales through increased collaboration and joined up working. In the action plan, cyber has multiple meanings. It means that everyone feels confident to be as safe as possible online. It means that businesses are as productive, efficient and resilient as possible. And it means that public services are effective and trusted by its users. And it also means the long term transformation of the economy through nurturing the industries of the future and a skilled digital workforce. The minister visited uh, Cardiff based ITSIS Consulting, that's an SME with expert system engineers as part of the launch of the plan. ITSIS specializes in cyber and intelligence testing and evaluation and system integration to provide innovative, secure and cost effective solutions to customers across the world. The publication of the plan comes ahead of the official opening of a new cyber innovation hub in Cardiff later um, that day when they published it, which brought together industry, government, defense and academic partners to grow the Welsh cyber security sector. The hub is creating a coordinated approach to skills, innovation and new enterprise and Welsh Government has invested three million pounds in this new hub. And this midday video as the ones on the new plan schedule, um, I know that I will not have too many viewers here, but um, I had to make a balance between interesting stuff for a few people and tons of time I put in. So it's only one topic on midday and not the whole list for uh, of, 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 a, of a long range of topics for Wales as I did in the past because I have to balance it a bit. It's the same with the history one. The midday and the evening ones will not attract that many people but I think both of those uh, kinds of videos are really important
for first of all a broader view of the people even if only a few are interested i still have hope in the people that in time um, they will have a look there and, and feel that they have information that that is important not only the current happenings are important we have to learn from from our history otherwise we are doomed to fail uh, by repeating it and we have to learn not only about the big picture of the whole uk we it's the same here in germany um, the people are always interested in federal politics but they need to be interested in state politics and local politics that's where a lot of important stuff happens and that's why i am putting my schedule the way it is in the morning of course you get the more global videos but uh, that are always the current ones but I think this mixture is important, even if not everybody is interested in, although they should be. And I'll see you in my next video. I'll be back.